Over the past year and a half, Bandmade has captivated me and risen to become my favorite band of all time. There are so many reasons, which I've discussed before, and that I may cover more in the future. But today I want to talk about my ultimate, all-time favorite Bandmade song. Many factors have contributed to this, but from the ground up, every single conceivable aspect of this song is a 10 out of 10 for me. I mean, first the band put a ridiculous amount of thought into this song, from how it was written, to how it was composed, and even the way it was titled. Second, Miku's lyrics are packed with an inspirational message about working to accomplish your dreams. To me, it almost feels like it's Bandmade's theme song, or their We Are song, giving it even more weight. Third, the composition of each instrument in this song is technically and dynamically stunning, but also helps tell the story of the song perfectly. I'm going to dive deeper into each one of those topics over the next few videos on this channel, so be sure you're subscribed with notifications on so you don't miss them. Also, I have a special related project coming soon with an amazing singer who old Mr. B discovered, so stay tuned. So what is the song? Well, I'll give you some hints, and I want to see your guesses in the comments before I reveal it. Hint number one. Mincho actually analyzed music that was selected for Grammy Awards as inspiration for the song. Did you get it yet? Be sure to comment it below if you guess it. Hint number two. The lyrics lay out Bandmade's approach or way of doing things, bridging the gap between their origin and future evolution. Hint number three, the original working title for the song was Rule. Hint number four, the lyrics reference the title of the album it's on, and was the last song written for the album. And hint five, it was the first music video released for the album it was on, and just celebrated its two year anniversary today. Thank you for letting me know that one, Eric. All right, this is your last chance to comment your guess below. Three, two, one. My all-time favorite Bandmade song, in my opinion, the magnum opus of Bandmade, Manners. Now, Manners is the fourth track of Bandmade's 2021 album, Unseen World, and in my opinion, it represents the culmination of the band's work so well, along with their future plans for world domination. From the perfect blend of heavy guitar riffs, pounding yet groovy drums, adventurous bass runs, and the absolute pinnacle of tag team vocals, and then on to the epic music video and inspirational lyrics. Manners represents Bandmade's accomplishments and their aspirations to continue to explore and expand their sound into the unseen world. So today I'm diving deep into the conception of Manners. Manners was a special song on Unseen World. It was the only song to be on both discs of the limited edition release. The Return to Origin edition, aka Roots, and the Genten Evolution Edition, aka Progress, one of the prominent lyrics in the song. Manners being the final song composed for the album was meant to bridge that gap between the two sets, with disc one collecting the songs that leaned more toward their origins of classic hard rock, and disc two featuring more progressive and experimental elements of rock and metal. In my opinion, all the songs do. It's just that the tracks on the Progress disc went absolutely ham, with songs like Warning, No God, Black Hole, HGK, and Giovanni. I mean, now with hindsight, we can see how this foreshadowed the extremely experimental approach we see on Unleash, blending both sounds so well. And to do this, Kanamicho took inspiration from a very unlikely source, or at least I was surprised by this. Mincho actually began analyzing music nominated for Grammy Awards, paying attention to the sounds and samples being used. And she said that part of her wanted this song to sound like Western music and that they wanted to show a new side of Bandmade. Just for reference, in 2020 when this song was composed, Billie Eilish and Lizzo were dominating the radio and won Grammys for Bad Guy and Truth Hurts. But this is really interesting to me because there's a pretty clear similarity in the melody and chord progression to a certain country pop song by Luke Bryan, which didn't win a Grammy, but was nominated for Teen Choice Awards and Billboard Music Awards. I actually brought up this song before when I was listening to the bass on Freezer. It had a really similar chord progression in the chorus, but in manners, it's the same melodic progression. Could be a total coincidence. It's just interesting that even though Mincho intentionally took inspiration from Grammy winning pop songs, she runs it through her filter of genius composer and comes up with something so musically interesting and meaningful. The Mincho filter could turn even this song into an amazing rock song. <laughs> I 
I have full faith that Mincho could take that song and turn it into an epic headbanging rock song. But I mean, it is pretty cool already. When it came to lyrics, Miku made the band themselves the subject of the song and included Unseen World as well. So essentially, this song became the theme song of the album, as well as the theme song for Bandmade themselves. Miku wanted the song to talk about Bandmade's protocol as a band, or their set of principles for the way of doing things. So at first, Miku thought they would call the song Rule, as in the rules they follow to accomplish their goals. And it could also double as a reference to their rule over the rock world after world domination. But Psyche felt that sounded too rigid and off-putting, so in the end, they settled on manners. Not referencing polite etiquette, but their overall manner of doing things. The message of manners is clearly conveyed throughout the lyrics, and it's a powerful one of recognizing their accomplishments up to this point, as well as inspiring future growth and aspirations. But for today, I just wanted to congratulate Bandmade on their two-year anniversary for the Manners music video, and their upcoming 10th anniversary, and next week will be the two-year anniversary for Unseen World, the album. And I'll be diving deeper into the musical composition of the song coming soon. Anyway, thank you for watching. If you liked this video, please pound the like button. And if you appreciate what I do, please consider supporting on Patreon. Obviously, it helps me make more time to make videos like this. But anyways, thank you again, and check out this Bandmade video here. Look, Psyche says do it. I, I, it's not up to me, guys.